What's going on you guys? Back here doing another video in the hobby room. Uh, got a cool video for you guys today. I know this one's going to be um, very helpful for you guys that race uh, one ten skill racing vehicles. Um, going to be going through a walkthrough on how I glue my front sidewalls on my front tires. Uh, also going to be going through a rundown on why I do it, when I do it, and um, the benefits of doing it. So if you haven't already, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. It only helps out my channel, um, getting it out to as many people as possible. Uh, and then, of course, subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell because uh, that only helps out my channel. All right, so let's get right into the video. Alrighty, so you're probably asking, what are the benefits of gluing the front sidewalls? And let me tell you, it's probably one of the best things you can do to your car to make it, one, easier to drive, two, your lap times will will decrease in lap times, which is a, obviously a good thing. Um, three, you actually end up finding that yourself that you can drive it harder into a corner and have a little bit more corner speed without tracks rolling at the end of the straightaway or apexing into the 180s. Um, you actually feel like your car has more usable steering, um, and what it does to the tire, it actually stiffens up the sidewall, um, and creates like a more of like a support barrier for the, for the tire not to fold over or roll over, uh, for instance, at the end of the straightaway. So that's kind of the benefits. And when typically I start doing the sidewall gluing is typically in the start of qualifying or maybe the start of like the main events. It really depends on what kind of steering I'm looking for. If my car is really edgy to, edgy to drive, I'll go ahead and glue the sidewalls and it like instantly helps with um, making my car easy to drive and of course picking up um, some speed going around the track. So let's get right into it. I'm gonna show you guys how I glue it and give you guys a detailed uh, video um, to hopefully help you guys out for your local tracks. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. So all you need to do this is a bottle of CA glue. I like using the Team Associated Factory Team Thin Glue. Um, if you are new to the hobby or the, to gluing tires in general, the thick glue might be, be best to use. I like using thin because it dries a lot quicker. So <clears throat> I'll start the process. I like using like a nice tip so I can kind of control where the glue is going as I can as you can see I'm just letting the glue kind of do its own thing work my way all the way across the whole tire and then I like usually gluing over the uh, the lettering on the side of the tire that's as far up as I go is right at the lettering and then I'll like gluing underneath the lettering. And then that's about it. So as you can see, that's as far as up as I go. It's pretty shiny on the outer, outer edges. And then here's a tire with no sidewall glue, as you can see, it's standard. Alrighty, so now that I showed you how to glue the front sidewalls and the kind of the technique that I use with the glue tip and the glue I use, um, I did wanted to go through and tell you guys that you can use this method for two or drive front tires, four or drive front tires. I've used it to win a nationals on my short course tires. Um, you can use it on your stadium truck fronts. Uh, typically, I only use the tire gluing sidewall trick on the front tires. I've never really tried it on the rear. Always a front end, front tire um, tip that I've always done. Um, highly recommend trying it out for you guys at your local track. It always is going to help you out with going faster and easier to drive. So what more can you ask? Um, if you... Really enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, or even hit the notification bell to hear and see my latest videos that I post. Uh, once again, guys, thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you guys on the next one.